TurboTax owner Intuit has agreed to pay $141 million to millions of customers across the country to settle claims from all 50 states and Washington, D. C. that it deceived users many of whom were low income into paying for tax services it advertised for free, New York State Attorney General Lettick. That's how many taxpayers in 2019 paid for tax prep software that they could have gotten for free, according to an audit from the Treasury Inspector General for Tax Administration sparked by the 2019 ProPublica report. Intuit, which started as an accounting software company in the 1980s, offered two free editions of TurboTax. Through the IRS free file program, TurboTax allowed customers earning around $34,000 as well as military personnel to file taxes for free, though the company withdrew from the program last year. The company launched its commercial free edition product several years ago. The program, which was a big financial success, lured customers with the promise of free services, though they were only free for approximately one-third of taxpayers, according to the New York Attorney General. Some filers were pushed into paying more than $200 for the product, according to the ProPublica investigation. The investigation also uncovered internal company documents that showed Intuit knew it was deceiving customers who were getting upset by the false advertising, though the company continued to deny any wrongdoing. The report sparked a backlash from customers and lawmakers and led to an investigation from the FTC, which announced it was suing the company in March 2022 for deceiving consumers with bogus advertisements. The commission also filed a complaint in a federal district court to force Intuit to halt. Inside TurboTax's 20-year fight to stop Americans from filing their taxes for free, ProPublica TurboTax to pay customers $141 million after allegedly steering them away from free services, CNN.